So the haters are saying that Shiba Inu is dead and that the chart looks boring. But if they studied their history, they would know that Shiba Inu looking boring is a bullish, bullish sign. You see, when people look at historical charts of Shiba Inu, a lot of them just look at this chart and see this flat line. It has a little spike up and then it just has an absolutely insane run up. And they assume that it was always like a flat line. Well, let me tell you, as a guy that bought hundreds of billions of Shiba Inu coins half a year ago, it was absolutely not like this chart makes it out to be. In fact, if we zoom out a bit and get a better look at what Shiba Inu was doing before those huge pumps, you'll see that the coin was super volatile, like there was all sorts of crazy stuff going on. So take a look at this. This is what it was like during the early days of Shiba Inu. You could notice that it would have a big run up and then basically do nothing and look kind of dead for a while. And that was always the case with Shiba Inu. Uh, you know, it, we always saw Shiba Inu basically crash down after a huge run up and then stay boring for like a month plus. And uh, every time that's happened, we've seen a new all time high and it just kept going higher and higher, getting a more and more insane run up each time. So the fact that we're seeing a flat line right now for Shiba Inu and the chart is looking boring is actually a really bullish sign. That's been the case many, many times with Shiba. And there's something that a lot of people don't understand when it comes to Shiba Inu and meme coins. And that is the fact that the audience, the Shiba Inu buyers, the retail traders are not the same retail traders that we have in Bitcoin. So this is Google Trends and it basically tells us what people are searching for across the world and with what volume. So as you can see, uh, around May, we saw Bitcoin reach the most searches. And right now we're at about a third of the search volume that people have for Bitcoin. Now, I want to show you what the search volume and the Google Trends looks like for Shiba Inu. This is what it looks like for Shiba Inu. So the search term is Shiba Inu Crypto. And as you can see during the mid-May pump, we had an absolutely insane run up of people looking up the Shiba Inu token. And now we're at 3% of the search volume we had during the mid-May pump. Okay. So as you can see, the retail traders that are into Bitcoin and Shiba Inu are pretty different. Uh, these are retail traders that do not behave the same way as each other, as you can see. Like they just have a completely different mindset. The people that buy meme coins have a very short attention span. They get bored pretty easy and they forget about the coin and, and they sell it and they leave it and then they come back to it when it's trending and pumping again. So this is super easy to make profit on. We've spoken with another Shiba Inu whale on this channel before that made about $60 million from Shiba Inu. And he's saying something similar to what I'm saying now. And that is the fact that you can reliably take profits by buying dead meme coins, what people are saying are dead. After the majority of the retail traders that buy them, you can get in when they leave and forget about it because they have a very short attention span, not the same way people have for Bitcoin and the blue chip alts. The meme coin space has, is very short attention span and it's quite easy to game that system. You buy when people are bored of the coin. For me, like I'm just telling you right now, I'd be shocked if we don't 10x Shiba Inu this year. Like I'd be absolutely shocked because you know, the way that we've seen Shiba Inu behave up to this point, I just think there's almost no chance that it's not going to break its all time high that we saw a while back. And yeah, what an all time high it was. Near the end of the bull run, we see a lot of micro caps pump anyway. And when people start taking profits out of Bitcoin and the, and the big coins, when they go up, we're going to see coins like Shiba Inu and the meme coins pump a lot. And the people that have a short attention span are going to come back in when it's trendy again 
and they're going to buy and get wrecked. That's just the way it goes in meme coins. Like the, this has always been the case. Like, look at this chart. I bet if I search Dogecoin, it's going to be a, a similar a similar chart on Google Trends. Yeah, pretty similar, right? Like we got Dogecoin that hit its peak um, during the mid-May pump. And now we're at about 6% of the search volume for Dogecoin. So, you know, like these charts are important to look at because it tells you what the mindset of people buying a coin even is. Like we know that people that buy meme coins have quite short attention spans and they're not, they're looking for, they're looking to flip their money in a few days. Like that's what the majority of people buy meme coins are looking for. When in reality, the best way to play this game is to buy time at times like this when things are looking boring. I've bought so many coins that people said were dead or like nothing was really going on. There wasn't much hype behind them and reliably gotten a hundred X plus out of them. Like it's, I've done it many times up to this point, you know, like this is just the way things are. Uh, let me think of another meme coin. Um, how about safe moon? Let's, let's look at what the chart for safe moon is. Wow, even crazier. 4% of the search volume we had during uh, April. You can see that there's different types of retail traders. There's the type of retail traders for the more long term that are buying the blue chip coins, Bitcoin, Ethereum, and some of the top 50 altcoins. And then you have the people that are buying meme coins that just dip in and out within a few days, uh, basically just going on what is trendy. It's so much easier to make money in meme coins, in my opinion. Uh, this is by no means a financial advice. This is just my opinion. Pay attention to the mindset of people in a given coin. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed, please drop a like and subscribe for more.